Little something going on down there. What is that? Huh? I don't want to lose it. Let's get down by the rocks. What is going on today, everyone? It is absolutely beautiful out here. It's mid 50s. I'm feeling much better here, you guys. I had a fever for the past week or so, so I'm super excited to see what happens here today, you guys. I'm in a brand new spot. We are gonna be joined with Dave from Sawdust City Magnets, you guys. Don't forget to check the links out in the description, you guys, to follow Dave's channel, or if you wanted to pick up a magnet of your own, there's a discount code down below. With that all being said, let's get the rope untied and see how our luck plays out today, you guys. Let's go. All right, we got our Brute Boss all tied off and ready to go for today, you guys. All of these docks here look very promising for some lost treasures here, you guys. This is also private property. We have special permission to be fishing here. It's looking good for today so far. Let's see what we can pull up on our very first throw. Ooh, first throw, a little bit of a lid of some sort. Looks like an old can back from the 60s or 70s when they were still made out of metal. Not bad for a first throw. I think we might have a little something on here. Not sure yet. <coughs> I don't know how I felt it, but I felt the sinker on there, you guys. Check that out. Got a decent lead on there. This might make its way to the tackle box. I haven't really decided yet. Let's keep throwing, though. Ooh, we got a bag of something here. I don't know if there's anything in there, though, you guys. What the heck is going on here? Well, it's a bag, but I have no idea what it was a bag of there, you guys. It almost looks like it was like a bladder system to something. Looks like it was supposed to be filled with water and this would open and close it at the top. No idea what for though. This is an excellent item to get out of the water. That's doing no good for anyone in there. Oh, there's a little something going on down there. Is it just a bunch of scrap -a -roo? I think so. Maybe like an old rusted chip off a 55-gallon drum or something. Who knows there? Oh, another chunk of the same 55-gallon drum alongside a little bit of chicken fencing there. Just some scrap -a -roo, you guys. I want to find something cool. Let's keep throwing here. Oh, look at that. Found a keychain, a little my little pony keychain link, but no keys on there, you guys. You never know what you're gonna find. Magnificent here, check it out. All right, guys, not much luck on the two docks to the left. We're gonna move on to the right and see if our luck gets any better over here. All right, that feels heavy enough. Here we go, here's a little something. Sign post, but no sign, man. Oh, we almost had a stroke of good luck there, but hey, we got some, well, we got a decent chunk of cash money scrap metal to turn in here, you guys. Maybe that sign still lingers in there somewhere in this area. Pretty cool, man. Maybe a no magnet fishing sign. What do you think? <laughs> That'd be funny. All right, so after about 25 throws, we know that there is stuff in here. Like I said, we just gotta be patient and eventually we will find it. Oh, we went over the top of something. Oh my lord, look at that. What in the world there? You're like some sort of a cable tie. Yeah, a little bungee cord there with one of the ends broken off. And it looks like the remnants of like a shopping cart or something, you guys. Look at that. What in the world? I have no idea what the heck that is there. Hey, there's a little spark plug on there, you guys. Hard to tell if it's for a marine engine or an automotive one, but pretty cool, man. First one of the day. I actually haven't seen one of these in quite a while there. It's a no name. I don't have any brand name on there. If it was on that porcelain, it definitely washed away by now. This thing's freaking old. Oh, look at that fishing lure there. That thing's a freaking zombie, man. This one's not gonna make it in the tackle box. It's really chewed on there. 
the rubber is just pulling right apart, which is unfortunate because I love finding nice lures. And we got the top or bottom of an old metal can lid, the non-aluminum kind. Ooh, there's a whole bunch of stuff going on here. Is it all just scrap? I mean, holy smokes, dude. That kind of looks like a file there, or maybe like a knife blade or something like that. The old kitchen knife. Got some braided wire, maybe like power line or cable or something like that. And yeah, we got an entire hardware store of nails on there, you guys. That's insane. Let's give this magnet a haircut. Holy smokes, look at the meteor we got on there, you guys. Do you imagine the value on this bad boy right here? It's like a million dollars. My biggest jackpot yet. Oh, there's a little something on there. Looks like the smallest dumbbell I've ever seen there, you guys. <laughs> look at that. Maybe it was like a pulley for like one of the boat lifts there, you guys. That would be my best guess. But really, who knows? Oh, do I got something? Yes, sir. Holy smokes. <laughs> wow, dude, look at that one. That's like a freaking record breaker right there. Those are like big nails. Those aren't small ones. Those are freaking massive, man. There's a whole house right here. Jeepers. Honestly, it's not a bad throw considering all of the scrap weight on there i mean it could be a couple bucks that we just pulled up not bad that is insane there used to be a hardware store right there huh all right it feels heavy is it plethora of nails that is absolutely incredible dude look at that the heck i mean it's got good weight i'm not lying it, it could be worth some money you throw it all in a five gallon bucket bring like 10 of them down there you're gonna get a steak dinner tonight all right i'm gonna give it one more throw over here if i get a magnet full of nails i'm gonna keep on moving because that's ruining my chance of clicking anything heavy hey there's a one bigger piece on there with a magnet full of nails, man. What do you think? A chunk of exhaust, maybe like some water line. Who really knows? But it's five pounds worth of five pounds worth of cash money scrap metal. Not a bad throw again. Wish there was an easier way to take all these off. Like I could just demagnetize the magnet, they would all fall off, but we don't live in that reality. All right, we got what looks like a belt buckle or something along those lines and maybe like a mattress spring or something. Not meant to hold too much weight there. I bet you that could be for a box spring. A little weight. Is it just a hundred nails or is it one decent piece here? Oh, it's... Looks like one decent piece there, man. Is that a chunk of a leaf spring? Maybe, man. I mean, I don't, actually, I don't think it's a leaf because it's perfectly straight and I don't see any like uh, the, the eyelets at the end. Is that a lawnmower blade? No. I have no freaking clue, man. It held something together. Do you think there were boat houses back here? Like what are all the, um, the, the metal or oh, wooden poles? Oh, for the docks, okay. Looks like it was the docks. For sure. Well, needless to say, we got some more cash money scrap metal, man. Maybe eight, nine pounds. Not a bad throw. Ooh, another chunk. Is that a freaking axe head? Oh, nope, I don't think so. <laughs> kind of looked like it at first. Any clue? What in the world? No. <laughs> Not at all. Paperweight. <laughs> right. A little something skipping along the bottom. Is it just a head of bolts? Let's see here. Oh, it was a freaking rock, dude. 
Dude. That rock is like, like, I dragged this rock all the way in here. There's a lot of iron in there. That's weird. I just can't, it's so big and large, I can't like lift it up, but. This is a big chunk of freaking iron. Holy smokes. That looks like a rock. Oh, there's a lot of iron in there though. Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna take this one home. We're gonna set this along this side. <laughs> it's just the fact that I dragged that all the way in here. <laughs> Little something going on down there. What is that? Huh? I don't want to lose it. Let's get down by the rocks. Uh, maybe a chunk of like a railroad rail or something there. I don't know, man. Little. L bracket thing. Broken, whatever it is. <laughs> Decent weight, maybe like five, six here. pounds. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I don't know, man. We call Could that be somebody uh, having a bad day. For sure, right? Could be a, like the frame to like some of the old docks. Who knows? Some cash money, scrap metal. Cha ching Another piece of something there, man. Um. <laughs> Yeah, just a long bent bolt. <laughs> That's really all it is. Could be a railroad spike of some sort. All right, guys, we got everything cleaned up. We're gonna wrap it up for today. Not the craziest day of finds, but we've had our fair share of stuff. Don't get me wrong here, and it definitely beats sitting on the couch for today. Don't forget to check out Dave's channel. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the thumbs up. Have a fantastic rest of your night, and we'll see you guys on the next one.